I chose Tess of the D'Urbervilles as our first novel to discuss, having studied it for an independent project. So I explored how Hardy challenges the romantic presentation of nature, but I hadn't really gotten the chance to explore the rest of the novel in detail, which was something that I wanted to share with the book club. So the novel lends itself to so many interesting ideas that we debated, such as the concept of fate and free will, and the idea of Tess as a tragic heroine who suffers so many injustices. But what was most interesting to talk about were the external influences that drive her fate. So this is her class, her gender, the Victorian conventions, and of course, the two men, Angel and Alec, who play such essential roles in determining her very, very tragic fate. I think that Tess's greatest flaw is her kindness and self-sacrifice for others. For me, the most evocative part of the novel was the fact that Tess and Angel's relationship only thrived in isolation. And I wonder whether their relationship was too challenging for a society at the time. It was a really thought-provoking read and I particularly found it interesting how Hardy challenges the perception of the fallen woman. I found it really interesting to consider how our view of um, the perception of women and things like marriage and religion have differed from how the readership would have viewed it at the time.